revenue, energy, and things like that. The lead operator of the Jubilee Oil Field, Talo Oil, has announced that the completion of repair works on the faulty compressor on the FPS Okwame and Chroma that resulted in the halting of um, gas export to the onshore processing plant for power generation will soon be restored. Uh, we know that because of this, the load shedding exercise that announced and unannounced has even intensified the more. Uh, we're here again. Uh, you, we're here again. It's a, it's a difficulty. It's as if we're trying to take a step forward and two steps back. The subject of energy and the way it, it goes. The problem with uh, this situation is the faulty nature of the compressor. Yesterday, I was in a meeting where um, we discussed these matters. Um, whilst we were at the meeting, we heard that our minister was way up there to check these things. The good news is that the work is completed even ahead of schedule. Yes, the work is completed. They are now going to do some test runs to ensure that if uh, they go full blast, they will not have this situation again. I am told that the FPSO Kwame Nkroma, the way it was modeled, makes it difficult to even get to where the compressor is. And like I told you, uh, I was in a certain meeting. Now, we are building a new FPSO. There's a second one coming. It hasn't come yet? Yes. So okay. the, uh, that's uh, the, 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 uh, the, 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 the thermal plants are different from what I'm talking about. Another FPSO. Yeah, another this one, we want to christen it uh, Professor Mills. <laughs> yes. <laughs> you must die before an FPSO would uh, be named after you. So if you want, you die early. <laughs> now, no, I should have achieved something too. What we intend to do <laughs> on this new one is to ensure that this uh, compressor is not fixed at a place where it is difficult because in this one, they have to jack it up and then build scaffoldings to be able to get to, to it. And so that is why it's delayed. We are also building uh, this, the second one, we have it to be friendly for the, for the maintenance work to be done. So seriously, this is because of the faulty nature of the, uh, the, the compressor. But work has completed, and very soon uh, we'll have it back on stream. Right. Okay. But so we also bought crude to power the system in the absence of this megawatts that was uh, so that's how can we're able to support the system yes. so it means that if we could buy a lot more crude we would improve the system no it's gas um <laughs> gas is what is used <laughs> very good question no no there are there, you know the thermal plants there are some that take gas and then crude now those that were using gas and could still use crude that is why we have bought okay. the crude it's not like so there are some that's solely on gas, on, on gas yes right like, a, you know, uh, uh, a sogle is yes. sold on gas. The thing I've noticed that is very much absent in the communication, especially from governments and government sources, is the thing about uh, install capacity and what the actual production is currently. We seem to have been lost, etc. Um, the difficulty also is whether the communication is still coming or needs to be coming about where we are with a car power plant that we expect in the next two months, because we're just ending November, uh, July. Will be in August and the next month ending. We're expecting the car power very well. Uh, I'm thankful, and I think that Ghanaians should be thankful that uh, uh, that's mischief. Where you're going is mischief. Mr. Oh, no, no, uh, Mr. Mamba <laughs> usually don't here. indulge in mischief. Mr. Mamba, Today is here. Is mischief. Mr. Mamba is here to tell us <laughs> the very fine details as to why the, the, the it has taken so long to 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 fix the problem. You see, my challenge, my difficulty with, with, with this government is that they don't, they don't even have the courtesy and the decency to tell us that we have this problem, so uh, uh, this, this will be the outcome. Was it not, announced, was it not announced by, I, I believe, the, and the, the Petroleum or the Energy Minister? Mm -hmm. And then also, I believe also uh, what was the announcement? The, BRA. the power, the power, uh, because the, the power had gone to what, what was the announcement? The, because uh, you know, if you announce you know that the, shed, the low shedding exercise had increased. It's yes, it had different. Yes, it had different. And we are giving reasons why nobody gave uh, hey. nobody we're gave the people of this country. Hey. Nobody gave they had the courtesy and the decency to tell the good people no, of no, this no, country. No, 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 no. Sometimes you have ears, but you won't listen. They I'm have, they have, have, they have, they have, they have, they have, they have indicated I to the people that, of this country. 
They have indicated to the people of this country that yeah, there's a compressor the problem. You know this. Okay. Hmm. You My view is that mm -hmm. the deepening of the load shedding is directly related to the, to the inability of the FPSO to process the gas. It's a machine. And it can, it can, it can quote unquote, to use the local parlance, it can get spoiled along the lines. Okay. Um, my worry is, this is supposed to be a new machine. I think this is the second time in a year that uh, they have reported. Uh, was there a problem with the construction? Was there a problem with the, with the quality of the construction? These are things we can interrogate. But beyond that, to tell us that there is a problem with the compressor and not link it with the deepening load shedding, mm. I think is disingenuous. We've done that. Nobody did that. And one person said that, oh, FPSO cannot deliver the gas because there's a problem with the compressor. With the compressor, the direct link, the the nuance is that because of that, there will be Excessive. a shortage mm. of of power generation. And that's true. And I think that that is what a good government must do to the people. That that was because we are, we are having problems, done. so we are going to have more. You understand? More for instance, but that's bad for, for instance, that, that will give government bad no, 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 no. For instance, that? and that, that, that is why no, that no, is why no, government no, was no, voted. No. In any case, we are hearing, for instance, <laughs> we are hearing that they are shutting down some of the units at Akosombo. The, the impact for me and my sister, that's Rose Plantain in front here, the impact is that the load shedding will deepen. I think that my sister, that Rose Plantain out there, deserves to be told that because of this, this will be the consequence. You understand? But these guys, they take all of us for granted. I think that they can have their way and 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 get along but, but this is what it mm. is okay. you understand uh, i am happy i am happy that uh, the 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 compressor you see is fixed i hope that the test runs will prove good and then we would we would have this this darkness that hangs over this whole country would come out a little i mean in some places there have been no light for 48 hours I, I had it for, I, I didn't have it for three days consistently. There you are. Until so it, so it is not because I wear a certain color, that is why I am saying. The good people of this country, are, are, it is impacting on their daily lives so very badly. Okay. And it, this has been going on. Mr. Chairman, take, you are that, asking me about car power. Look, has anybody heard anything about it? Up to the days before we're rising, it is now that government has brought agreements for what they term emergency. It is now that I have seen in Parliament. And Parliament has approved two agreements to bring emergency power. So your point is? The government told us when they were doing car power that it was an emergency. Car power came and told the good people of this country that we don't do emergency. We do short to medium. So government knew that they needed to do emergency his Excellency, the President, tells all of us that he will fix the problem. Yes, that's what the problem is. It will fix itself. After all, Sankofa, gas, Sankofa will produce gas. ENI is contracting to, to build a, 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 a power plant or, or, or GE because there is gas. They are all coming. But how about today? We have been living with this for four years, and they didn't know that when you have a problem, you take emergency measures. Thank you. And the people of this country were told in no uncertain terms that with the breakdown of the FPSO in Chroma, there will be shortage of power. This was made abundantly clear. Like but I said, sometimes it's difficult to wake somebody who is pretending to be asleep. It's much easier to wake somebody who is actually asleep. Meaning what? Meaning that no he matter, has heard it. No matter what you do. No, no matter what we say, they will say they've not heard. But that's not a fair comment. Oh, it is. We have, look. Because, who does because the energy who, crisis is being experienced no, no, no. by we every country. Ask, ask, ask him to produce. We are talking about the breakdown. Ask him to produce the communicator we, we, told us. We, we, we are talking about FPO, FPSO Nkrumah, Kwame Nkrumah, where the people of this country told that that, 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 that machine is faulty or not. We were told. The Minister of uh, Power, the, uh, the Minister of Petroleum, the VRA have all said this. The but, but if you have, 
Show me. But, but ask if, him. But if put him to speak, but, bro, but, but, but put him if, to speak, no, no, bro. But, but why did you communicate? But, but truthfully, if, I had, I had there was so a many problem. people have heard it. I'm sure the cameraman because has the heard media it. had gone to the them. Why is it that they said what? But you are saying you didn't they hear it. No, I am saying that I am saying that I heard about the problem of the compressor on the FPS. Yes, it was announced that gas. No, was not going to yeah, come yes. because there was a problem with the compressor. You heard yes. that one? I heard that one. Yes. But somebody must tell me that, is related that because of, of this, that. We're not there will be a, 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 yes. Somebody show me the community. <laughs> tell fact, me. In fact, okay. that was also told. It was not told. So, if you have not heard, it doesn't mean Ghanian. that Ghanaians have not heard. Okay. The point is that these are machines. Ababa, show, and me, then, show me and the communicate. Tell me who issued that statement to say that there will be okay, a, 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 a worsening you're on fire, level right. of... I took it, when you did I, an interjection, I, you said he, I, now you're making one too many. Yeah, I, 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 to sure, sure, sure. I took it as a given that as a parliamentarian, you would have heard it. <laughs> ah, look. So that if you ah. had told me, I would have brought that communication. That's a, that's, you know? that, that's now, a guy. Now, the point is that <laughs> these are machines. They will break down. Mm. The issue is, if they break down, are we working on it or not. Okay. I'm happy to inform to you that the work has been completed even by, uh, by, by, by before schedule. Mm. So what's your issue? Okay. Mr. Mr. Maliba. On the issue of fixing the energy crisis, we have stated time with our number. The, in fact, I'm sure he has not heard that one too. Just last week, Friday, the Minister of uh, Power in Kumasi said that we're going to fix it. In fact, uh, the African Center for Energy uh, 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 my Policy. friend, my, my friend, uh, uh, I mean, yeah. Antes, uh, the organization yeah. has corroborated what government said. That seeing the things that he is seeing, I heard they indeed co congratulated government. government. The steps, yeah. So you see, it is difficult once again okay. to wake somebody who is asleep this. because of the position you to be asleep. The, po the position you occupy, as far as we are concerned, mm -hmm. um, in relation to energy matters, etc. Would you say that we've issued? Or can you confirm whether we've issued the LC for that 15 million we need for the car park? Oh, yes. It has been issued? Yes. We can say it's as yes, a fact? Yes, we have guaranteed it. Um, when, when, when was that done? Because oh, no, no. I, 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 you see, because of... Uh, uh, because of, it was supposed to have been of, done by GMPC. Because because of, yes, yeah. and I, I before, because, because of, of where I, I am. No, yeah. I, I can tell you that it was position. guaranteed. When did you even, even the distance, the crude, the crude that I talked about, has also been guaranteed by GMPC, and we are doing those things. Okay. So, so, so I can I, assure I, I, you. Are we going to get the, ca ask the ask car power coming on time? Coming? Yeah, it's coming in September. Um, I'm End told, of September? I'm told, yes, I'm told I've not gone there. I'm told the platform. We don't want it to come before they start. The platform is going to sit on the sea, isn't it? Where? Yes. Uh -huh. So the platform has been created. So Just along the shore somewhere. Yes, have yes. Okay. So those things, those matters have been taken care of. He can be rest assured. Chavante. Cool down, don't worry. Cool down. All right. So <laughs> now, the, 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 the excessive subject is about the communication. I have had difficulties with the way sometimes the communication is undertaken. And just like perhaps w the, the, the sentiments that Mr. Chairman Tingha has is about the communication. How do we have to tell people that really now we're telling Gridco to do um, the, the, the shutting down themselves because of perceived system failures that they may envisage? Because when you call the ECG hotlines, they tell you there are some networks that are out of our hands. So sometimes Gridco would have to do the shutting. I was spoken to Gridco PRO, um, I believe on Tuesday or Monday. He says it's not, that's not true. In my view... But you speak to ECG, top ECG official, and they tell you that's the fact. In my view, this energy crisis, the communication of it should be left to the agencies. Um, I don't think that government officials should be doubling in so this. So you can just speak on the peripheries? Yes. Oh, so right. that we will, when they lead a discussion, we can now join. So Gridco, VRA... So and whatever they say, we should take as facts. Exactly, because they are the technical men. <laughs> they are the technical men. To be honest with you, yeah, but, for my, but, but, but for where I sat yesterday, I wouldn't have known this information. And I'm sure most of my colleagues in the communication have not had privileged information on this. But just because, luckily, I sat in a meeting yesterday which discussed these matters. You see, let okay. me say this. We have to wrap up on this let, because let, our time is up. Let me say this. In the past, we have had load shedding timetables. I need to inform the good people of this country that 
Um, I can expect light now. I, I don't expect light now. When, when, by virtue of the fact that the compressor on the FPSO uh, uh, had a problem, mm. and so therefore gas would not come from a trouble, mm. gas would not come from uh, the Jubilee fields into the Atuabo uh, enclave, did they bother to put up an advertiser's advert? Is that how they call it? Notice that uh, a new schedule of, of... When did you last see a schedule of, of, of a, a load shedding? When did you last see? Actually, it's been absent for a very long time. Come on. I'm not so, holding brief for them, so, but they said something. So, 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 what I am saying is that they knew mm. that because of this challenge at I think officially, FPSO. officially, what the ECG has said mm -hmm. is that because of the the, the consistency of supply, mm. they cannot. But they are on the a schedule. Consistency, consistency. Yeah. Yes, they 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 are they are on a schedule. Yeah. But only they can't give the. I am saying that they, yeah. they I am I am maintaining that. Mm -hmm. Yes, we got to know that there is a challenge with the compressor, and that gas has been cut off. But nobody had the courtesy to come to all of us as Ghanaians to say that because of this challenge, expect a lot more darkness. But that is the reality we are living with. And I think that out of respect for the Ghanaian, the necessary thing to have, to have been done was to come to us to say that we have a challenge. After all, we have been living with this for four years. Nobody has, nobody has, they, they have not solved it. Uh, if, if we have to go through it, a, 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 a deep in phase for another two months. Hopefully, hopefully, like you say, from the position of privilege that he comes from, hopefully, maybe in the coming week, uh, uh, our, our woes will be lightened up a little. I hopefully. pledge, I pledge that. Hey. Yes, I'm pledging. Oh, that's okay. Yes, I'm pledging okay. that. Let him go ahead. Anytime the uh, utility services or the Ministry of Power or that uh, the other Ministry of uh, uh, petroleum, petroleum come out with Unofficial. some communique. I will personally call Pierre and tell him that this is what has been said so that he can be part of the good people of this country. At the moment, he has not heard. Everybody has heard. <laughs> so Nobody has heard. Hey, where, right. is the, where is the schedule? Okay. All of us live with the schedule. Where is the schedule? All right. Uh, 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 where uh, is the schedule? And, and that will be... And that'll be uh, um, um, uh, Abby, where is the schedule? Wh wh when is the party going to announce for the calling of nominations, opening of... For the NDC. Mm. I had interactions with one of the executives, and um, they are scheduling it in November. October would have been when the pilgrims will be returning from Mecca. Mm. We don't want to saddle them with so many activities. So we are thinking somewhere in November. OK. Mm. That'll be cool. Uh, in Parliament, are you expected to have a press conference with the minority? Yes, we are preparing to have a on press what? conference on the mid-term review of the budget. OK. Oh. And you, and really, do we have time to talk about it? You, you have noticed you some few things. That's no, why their to... own party take them to task. This is not the opposition we knew. Those days, when the government comes out with a statement, that evening, they will come up with a statement. This oh. time, but when, 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 when the issues have been, have been discussed and everybody has gone to sleep, you are not coming to resurrection. Who has gone to sleep? That's why your people are taking you to task. Who, who has gone That's to sleep? That's why your party so, so, so is what taking are, what you to task. What are you raising? You are not an efficient, oh. effective opposition. After how many days? Uh, one week now, since that, that review has been done, yeah, yeah, uh -huh. then you yeah, people yeah, are now yeah, saying that you are now saying that you are saying that you, you want to talk about that thing again. Those days, JH Mensa. Uh -huh. I love to see them. Come they are okay. no more around. Okay. Oh, oh, you see, it's okay. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> a great me <laughs> and, no. and the current prop. It is, it, is very people, your people. it is very convenient for him to do you so. You think it's a strategy? Well, if they did it then, it doesn't mean that as they did it then, it must be done the same way. What is important is the content. What is important is what we relay to the good people what of this will country. You, what will you well, relay? I mean, we are going to tell the good people of this country that uh, the minister came to parliament and achieved nothing. Indeed, he just brought gloom to this country. Two things he did. He came and reviewed every time that he had set. He came, you remember, budget was in, budget was in November. In February or so, he came and told us that because of changing petrol, uh, uh, crude prices, 
uh, he will not be able to meet his target. He came back just to confirm the same gloom. There was not a single bright spot in the presentation of the Honorable Minister of Finance. That was not. So you're going to focus attention on some of it. We want to tell the good people of this country that this is a government that is failing. This is a government that is incapable of managing nothing. They have what, look, economics is not what myself or Amalba decides to talk about. Economics has measurements. And the measurements is independent of me or him. It's independent of the political color. Okay. This government said it was going to achieve under oil, with oil. This government said it was going to achieve a GDP, shameful GDP of 3.9. Even today, they have come back to tell us that even that 3.9, they can't do it. They will have to do 3.5. This government told us that they were going to do a deficit of 6.5. Today, they have come back to say, oh, we can't do it. Oh, we are going back to a deficit of almost 8. They said that they were going to do uh, 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 an inflation of 10 or 11. Today, they are coming to say we will end the year at 13.5. The only thing he came to ask for was money uh, over 800 million CD to go and pay debt. Is it paid so, debt or service debt? Oh, service debt. It's the same, same thing. Oh, the, right. we, the only thing, and, and, and also, that there can be no development because he took a chunk of 600 million out of the uh, capital expenditure uh, 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 budget. That is the... That you is said, the Chairman Sager, you are doing your press conference already here. Wait, look to me. Oh, you no, know. this press conference is coming at a time when the horse has bolted, so <laughs> for me. All right, whoever are in the studio, the Abraham Amaleba. The horse has only and, um, <laughs> uh, You know that the members of parliament have gone on recess. Yes. Yeah, you should be, you should be going to your constituency a lot, oh, yes. I think. Yes. Uh, that would be Borgar Central. Yes. And he's a member of uh, the NDC's legal team. Abraham Amaleba is also a law lecturer, and thanks for joining me, Abraham. Thank you. And um, he presents Emmanuel Chamantinge Jacob is a member of parliament for Ayawaso West Borgar constituency. don't have any and people. thanks for joining me, <laughs> and Emmanuel, if I can call you that. Oh, yes, yes, yes. I'm okay, that'll be it. And uh, we're going to have... You can call me, Kobna. Oh, I like to be Okay, Kobna. And the yeah. champong. I forgot about yeah. that. Okay. He's a humble...